Hello and welcome back to News 8 Now. I'm Steve Minnick. Despite a recent arson arrest, some people in Lewiston tell us they are worried about the number of house fires in the area. Jackie McBurney is facing arson charges in connection to a fire at 168 Bartlett Street. Police say she set the fire that caused minor damage on New Year's Day, but a second fire 10 hours later destroyed the building, leaving 12 people homeless. Police say she will likely be charged for that as well. The two fires have people in the neighborhood on edge. It scares me each and every day. I have to wake up and worry, you know, do I, do I, do I have space to get the kids out of the house? A am I going to get my sister out? And what's going to happen? Am I going to die? Mick Burney also lived in a Birch Street building that was destroyed by fire last September. There is no word from police if they believe that she was involved in that fire. In Washington, members of the 114th Congress are sworn in. Maine Senator Susan Collins met with Vice President Joe Biden to take her oath, while members of the House held ceremonies with re-elected House leader Republican John Boehner. Maine's Bruce Poliquin begins his first role in the House of Representatives today. Poliquin spoke about his new role. I'm grateful for this opportunity to be here. I'm an honest, hard-working Mainer, and I look forward to the challenges ahead, and I will fight, always stand up and fight for the interests of our families back in the 2nd District. And Poliquin says he has already begun to work with Republicans and Democrats from across the country to create a better business climate to create more jobs. And thank you for joining us here on News 8 Now. Make sure to check back at WMTW.com and our mobile app for the top stories and weather anytime.